hey you guys welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm gonna show you guys how i did this nail set on my client today so stay tuned to see exactly how i did this look i started out recording with the nail tips already on these are not polishes universal nail tips they are pre-shaped in this stiletto shape and i'm going to be removing the shine from those i also wanted to say please excuse my nails you guys i was making press lines and got black polish all over my hands before my client got here so please excuse them they look crazy but um i've already pushed back her cuticles and, rem and removed the shine from her natural nails and after this I'm going straight in with application because we didn't even shape these any further. She did not want a sharp stiletto. Now I'm priming with Mia Secrets Dehydrator and I'm going to be using Tammy Taylor's primer which is my current fave right now and the acrylic color I'm going to be using is from Not Polish. It's called I Lie Like You A Lot. I'm going to have that link down below in the description box for you guys and I'm using a Not Polish number 14 nail brush along with Not Polish's monomer to do this nail look today. So make sure you guys check out the description for my discount code and links to all of the products that I'm using. Also wanted to mention that the whole application process and first half of this video is in real time. I did not speed up any clips until the end when I was buffing and also placing the gold balls or pearls because that took a while. So I sped that up. I'm about to pinch the tip of the nail tip because I could not get that little portion off at first with my nail brush. And I know that somebody might say something about that, so I'm sorry, girl. But I needed to get that off, and I didn't have any gloves. I ran out of gloves. I got to go to the nail supply store tomorrow and re-up. So someone asked me to do a life update video so shout out to you if you asked me that and before I give you guys a life update I just want to say I'm sorry if I sound bland or tired it's just late when I'm doing this voiceover so I'm trying to kind of be I'm not trying to talk loud or anything but um basically I'm just working on trying to get my life together and get my life right and you know I have a lot of things that I want to do and i'm just working on that i'm trying to take life day by day like i have so many things that i want to do i want to get in the gym i want to do more content i want to um do classes you guys know this like i'm also in the process of redoing my room because i really wanted to you know i used to do nails from home and my room just didn't really have like any type of personality to it. it was very bland and I realized like I did not like my room at all like so for Christmas to myself I decided to get myself like a bed and some things to like redo my room because I just feel like it's important to be happy in the space you're in like I had started to just not want to be home because I just didn't like being in my room it just wasn't me so I've been working on that and just things behind the scenes for real trying to get my life right I recently purchased some new stuff to make press lines 
So I want to know in the comments if you guys would enjoy that type of content too, like me showing you guys the press-ons I'm making or something, or like just like certain type sets you can make for press-ons easily, like easy like press-on tutorials or something, because I made some press-ons today and I'm going to show y'all a video clip or whatever, but um i have fun doing it like freestyling on there and so yeah let me know if that's something that you guys would want to see in the comments
this is what my application looks like next i'm going to be reshaping these and then e-filing which i didn't film but i did show you guys me buffing the nails after we e-filed them and after i finished buffing she went to go wash her hands I'm using Zule's bling adhesive to adhere the gold pearls and I try to be as generous as possible without putting too much glue um, and ruining the nails or like making it look messy because my client is pretty rough handed and was worried about the pearls falling off. I also made sure that I sprayed the nails with this spray, this glue drying spray that I got when I was in Florida at the Studio Nail Supply. Um, I don't have the name of that at the moment that I'm doing this voiceover, but I'll make sure I add that to the description box for you guys tomorrow. And then when I put my top coat on, I actually went over the pearls with the top coat as well, just so it could act as an extra sealant to help prevent the gold balls from coming off because I really don't want them to pop off. So she's gonna let me know how they do and if anything happens, but fingers crossed, I have a lot of faith in my Zule's bling adhesive. This stuff is really, really strong. I got these gold pearls from Amazon. I also got them in silver as well. And I will have both of those links in my Amazon storefront, which is linked down below.
the top coat that i'm using today is the not polished glossy top coat which will be linked down below and my discount code is sid so you guys can save money when shopping with not polish I'm using Kyushio's cuticle oil in vanilla bean and sugar. I got this from my local nail supply store, but I have the name in the description box. I'm not sure where you can purchase it. I'm sure if you just Google it, it'll pop up somewhere, but this smells really good. And after this, that's the end of the video. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you made it this far, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you guys in my next video.